Good Monday Musing. Today I'm going to talk about how you recharge yourself. Recharge your batteries when you're maybe feeling depleted, feeling a bit low, whether it's emotionally, physically or spiritually. We all have those times when we just need to look internally into ourselves to find out why we might be feeling what we're feeling and actually what can we do to make that difference and raise not just your energy levels but your physical health, your emotional health and your spiritual health. There's lots of different ways that we, we all work with this. We all tend to find our own ways and follow our own path with how this can happen. Sometimes we can get a, a little bit stuck and we don't know what the right direction is to go in, what the right method might be to help ourselves. So I'm just gonna talk about a few things that I've found over the years have helped me and have also helped my clients and my students and have found that they've helped them just to boost them up again, recharge them, help them move in the direction that they, they need to. So working on an energetic level, obviously we're working on our physical and our emotional and mental and our spiritual health. And by keeping our energy levels at an even keel, we can work on our chakra points as well as the different layers of our energy field. So Reiki, crystals, sound, anything that can work on what we call that higher vibration will help to realign, rebalance and, and just reboost you, which will in turn recharge everything that you need. So by working on that energetic level, you will find that you will help your emotional and your physical health. Sometimes what we need is, is just a bit of time to connect to our inner and our higher selves. And sometimes the best way that we can do this is, is through meditation. It's through quiet time. And time where you can just delve internally and start to rethink, relook at maybe the direction you're going in and the path that you wish to go on. So what you want to do with that is find some meditations. Maybe you enjoy spending time in nature walking. If you're out walking on your own, it can be quite meditative and by being like that it can help clear the mind which in turn will give you more focus more time for thought and more time for maybe ideas solutions and what you need to just give you that extra boost so again walking if you like to exercise outside running Anything like that can actually give you the time and the space for you. Take the dog out for a walk if you've got a dog. If it starts to rain and you enjoy spending time out in the rain, obviously don't get cold, but just enjoy that time that can clear the path so that your mind can feel a little, a little bit more focused. In the same essence, sometimes it's nice to spend time with our family and with our friends because by spending time with them, it, it gives you the opportunity to talk. It gives you the time and the place to evaluate what might be going on, how you might feel and again, give you other ideas from what they might say to you when you've discussed maybe things that you might have on your mind days out so that it takes you out of your your normal environment your normal place of maybe where you live or maybe where you work as well especially if you do work from home sometimes being able to have that time in a, a different place can help maybe combine having that time on your own or with family as well as spending time in nature go to the local beach walk along the seafront paddle in the sea, just reconnect with nature in that way with everybody and, and time out. Sometimes we just need to feel grounded, we just need to feel connected to our bodies because sometimes you can be 
too much all over the place, you don't know where you're, whether you're coming or you're going or what you need, where you want to go, where you've been. So sometimes just having that connection and feeling more grounded can help. So go outside, take your shoes off, take your socks off, put your feet into the grass, feel connected to Mother Earth, feel the energies that are there, feel grounded just so that it can bring you back to the here and now a little bit more. Sometimes a nice bath, a nice book, if there's hobbies that you enjoy doing, sometimes that can just be enough to give you the boost, to make you feel more connected, more calm, more peaceful, more tranquil. Sometimes taking the time out from the everyday chores and, and doing other things that you enjoy that sometimes we don't get the time to do and we don't allow ourselves to have that time. So find a good book, go and have a nice bath. If you enjoy a glass of wine, a nice meal out, maybe you enjoy baking or cooking. Whatever hobbies appeal to you, find something that gives you the time to focus on yourself. Because by focusing on yourself, looking at what you need or maybe talking about what you need will sometimes give you all that is needed to be recharged so that you can help your physical, your emotional and your spiritual health.